warning warning to you beloved if i were you right now i would choose my words wisely i would only say things that are most important i would mind my words because the Lord said, after all these years, after all these months, after all this while, you've arrived at a stage of your life when you don't need to just speak. But because you have become this powerful that your words and your thoughts manifest in lightning speed. You've come this far, beloved. Whatever that you, you, you speak forth, not your word, though, because you, 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 God is in you. You are one with Christ. You are one with God. And the words that you speak are not your word. And so this word, because you've been speaking these words for a very long time, they'll become a part of you. And when you speak this word out, they don't waste time to manifest. You see things coming to reality, beloved. You see things coming to pass. You, you see things happening. The Lord is saying, be, discern your words, discern what you speak. Because you've you've God has like lifted you to a to a place where you're no longer you are not natural, you're not you're not ordinary. You are supernatural, beloved. You are supernatural. I need to understand that the, the, the life and death lies the power of the tongue. Even though to some people it may not be effective because they are not conscious, they have not are groomed themselves because they are not um, fully connected to God, and so these things will not make meaning to them. Perhaps you know it, it, it may it may make meaning to them in negative form, but they wouldn't care. But you, being conscious of who you are, being conscious of Christ in you, being the hope of glory, being conscious of your connection with the Lord, you are very much aware that whatever that you do, whatever that you say, creates negative or positive impact, beloved. And God is reminding us, he said to mommy to tell you that your words have been so, so, not your words by the way, but the word that you speak, but that words that come out of your mouth have been creating impact. They've been manifesting. Are you know it or not? So choose your word wisely. Proverbs 20, um, 18 verse 21. Death and life are in the power of the tongue. And those who love it will eat it's fruits. If you love negativity, you're going to be reaping. If you love positivity, why not say these things and, and enjoy the fruits of... Why, 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 why not being positive and enjoy the fruit of positivity? Why not being positive? Why not choose life and enjoy the fruits of life? God is saying to someone this moment... That your life isn't the same anymore. You've come this far. You've arrived at the stage of your life when things you say, money, you, 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 you can testify. You can testify, beloved. It is not easy to arrive at this stage of your life. It is not easy. Proverbs 17, verse 27. He will restrain his word, is, has knowledge. And he who has a cool spirit is a man of understanding. Yes, always learn to have a cool spirit. Restrain your word. Choose your word wisely. Let your words be seasoned, beloved. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You are so powerful. God was speaking. Say, now listen. See, see what's happening. See what's going on. See what's going on in your life. So much happening. So much happening. And the word of God has given to you, beloved. These words are real. They are true. They don't come and return to God to God void without accomplishing what they came here for. So you speak this word, knowing fully well that they are actually manifesting. Whether people believe you or not, whether people hold take God's word from you or not, because they've heard you. They will experience these things. They will see these things. They shall understand these things. They shall feel these things. They shall, they, shall, they shall be a part of these things happening. So you are so powerful. 
Mm. Someone is so powerful this season. Not just this season, but beyond, beloved, because God has elevated you a state to, to, to a state of your life when His word in your life, like they 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 just you just you see them coming to reality quicker than before, quicker than expected. God bless you so much. Keep speaking those those great words. Keep speaking those great words. And as you speak them, expect to see the manifestation quicker in your life, even the lives of those you are communicating to, in the name of our Lord and Savior Christ Jesus. Hallelujah.